Hello everyone. I had a sudden urge to record a video, so here we are. Now, you might know me, you probably know me from my short educational English language content on TikTok and Instagram, where I really focus on the English language. And I love to do that. And as you know, I was born in the UK. Uh, sorry, I was born in the United States, raised in the UK, but I'm Polish. And that's why my accent is so great. And I'm a native and I use my gifts to teach. And I love to do that. But one thing I haven't done is made actually videos more about my life and my journey of moving to Poland. And I think that's very interesting. And potentially you guys could learn a lot from that side, from my more personal side. So I thought I'd make more videos like this. Here's me trying to make a video about my life and my experience in Poland. Consider this like a video diary, okay? And so because this is a video diary, and I am an opinionated person. I like to have opinions. Don't take what I say here maybe too seriously in the sense of this isn't me saying this is right, this is wrong. It's just going to be my opinion and it's just going to be how I feel based on what I'm experiencing and my life experience at this moment in time. You know, opinions change, experiences change people. So it's just going to be a video diary of what's going on in my life at the moment. And let's start there. Today, um, me and my girlfriend went to our local farmer's market. She said, Daniel, do you want to go to the farmer's market with me? And I said, sure, let's go. And actually, I have a bag of stuff here. Mm. Got some onions from the farmer's market. Got some tomatoes. Tomato, tomato from the farmer's market. Uh, what else do we have here? We've got some cherries. We've got some cherries from the farmer's market. We've got some cucumbers from the farmer's market. I believe I got some apple juice from the farmer's market. We got a lot of stuff from the farmer's market. But almost what was even better than what we bought was like the conversation we had with the, the lady, the vendor, who was selling the vegetables and the fruits to us. It was great. And the lady said to us, Jak tylko możecie. Uciekajcie z miasta, uciekajcie. Um, she said, run away from the city and go to the village. And go to the village. And I see her point, right? Because we were talking about fruit and vegetables from like Lidl, Lidl, <laughs> from Lidl, uh, and how they're, they're not only more expensive, but they're also less healthy, packed with like GMOs and the meats full of hormones and stuff like that and that more people should shop in the farmer's market. She said, run away from the city. I can't live here. It's unbearable. Just go to the village, go to the countryside, life, real life, more peaceful. And we were essentially like agreeing with her, even though we do live in the city at the moment. But I told her, proszę pani, ja już uciekłem z Anglii, so it's already good, right? She said, run away from the city to the village. I said, I've already run away from the UK. So like we're making progress. And what do I mean by that? Remember, this is just my opinion. But if we look at this um, analogy of run away from the city to the village, you can see this as like a microcosm for UK is the city and Poland is the village. If we're looking at as a country, the UK is more like a city and Poland's more like the village. What do I mean by that? I think everyone can see that the world is changing. The world's changing right in front of our very eyes. 
you know, technology is advancing at a rapid rate. Uh, prices are going through the roof, inflation. It's more about money, 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 money. And technology is kind of killing uh, relationships and communities and even the connection between people and families. I think everyone can see that. At least the people who were around before the internet, they can see that the world is changing. We can see it, of course. And I was even born in the internet era and I can still see and ex feel what's going on because I listen to older people, but we can see that the world is changing. And just observing the world and how it's changing, it's made me think, which way do I want to go? Do I want to go more towards, you know, the technology, keep running towards the technology and um, money and capitalism and greed and new things and not tradition, new values, if there are any values, or actually, hold on, Maybe this old way of life, there's something to it. There's some value there, you know, the way people used to live with communities and values and you no know, true connection between people and not only caring about making, let's say, money. It's, it's a complicated topic, but you see where I'm going with this. And I just think Poland's that village a bit more still where we still have a bit more sense of community and togetherness and connection amongst people and we can still have a garden in our house and the uk is more like let's just put everyone in a flat everyone's just nine to five working to pay off their flat and just survive, barely survive. There's no connection. People don't even like say hello to each other on the street or in the shops. And you go to a self checkout. Obviously, I'm simplifying this argument and it's very nuanced, but this is how I see it. Poland is still a bit of a village. UK is this advanced modern city that it looks pretty on the picture, but the reality of it isn't that pretty. And what comes with this modern, new, techno technologically advanced, capitalistic, greedy way of life. And we can even look at it from a different analogy of a farmer's market or the supermarket, yeah? Uh, village, city, farmer's market, supermarket, UK, Poland. And I think I, I'm realizing that this is where I want to be. I grew up in the city and in this industrialized world and there's parts of it that I wouldn't trade like the fact that I'm able to speak to you right now and um, teach people on the internet that's, that's a necessary part of my life and there's some parts I wouldn't trade but I still want to, to you know go to the farmers market embrace the village maybe you know pull some vegetables out of the ground, cut some grass, walk around on some fresh grass, speak to people, you know, look them in their eyes. That connection that we were speaking to the lady at the farmer's market, that's a real human connection. She was so nice. She was so genuine. You don't really get that nowadays, less and less. If you go to Lidl, you're going to talk to a machine. You check out with a machine. If I go to the farmer's market, I'm checking out with a human being. I can even negotiate a price. You can ask me how I'm feeling. I can ask her how she's doing. Real human connection there, not technology, technology, technology. So that's what I want you to think about. And that's what I'm thinking about at the moment. Technology or tradition, supermarket or farmer's market. Uh, and I, I like being in Poland for that reason. It's still a bit more of a village. It's a bit more of a farmer's market here than in other Western societies. Uh, and I'm happy. And that's why I like it here. And that's why I, uh, I appreciate it here. And I also want to make these videos where I tell you what I appreciate and what I like about Poland. So maybe you will start appreciating Poland more.
because the grass is always greener on the other side. You can always say, ah, Poland, shit, it would be better to live in the UK, but you know, perhaps you need some perspective and perhaps I can help you achieve that perspective. So that's where I'm at at the moment. This is my video diary. I guess I was rambling. I don't even know how long I've been speaking. Um, I'm new to the, these kinds of videos. So let me know if you like enjoyed them, if they're worth doing, if you want to see more like this, because if you do, I'm pretty sure I can get used to this. You know, it's a long form of content and it's another way for you to learn English. Obviously, I have my videos where it's like, grandma, don't make this mistake. Blah, 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 blah. This means this. But this is also a form of learning English, you know, listening to someone. And it's, it's like relevant because I'm speaking about Poland. So thanks for watching. Won't take more of your time. Go about your busy day. Uh, do something real life, you know. Go to the farmer's market today for a change. Peace.